Hello, walk off. You want to give your heart and life to God and Jesus? Call CBN at 1 800 775 9413. Uh, that's a real prayer line if you need prayers for anything. Um, they'll pray with you. They're pretty awesome. Um, they also teach you how to pray for yourself if you need to learn how to do that. They'll encourage you to do that. Um, they have awesome resources. So this is the sinner's prayer. They usually ask, ask this after sermons, after church. So during Thanksgiving, um, during the holidays is a good time to go out and ask people if they would like to receive Jesus. Chris, Christmas, you know, is a time we celebrate when God sent his son, Jesus. Um, to be born on Christmas Day, the Virgin Mary. And Joseph. So there was a census. Uh, they were gonna, you know, count the people and uh, it's a pretty, pretty amazing story. I really like um, how Charlie Brown them tell it in their uh, Christmas story. Um, so one of the kids asks, what does Christmas mean? And so Linus um, quotes the Bible and Luke and uh, so there's so many ways in which Christmas or Jesus is included in all kinds of ways we sing the music you know silent night holy night um, so after our Thanksgiving I really like to get out the holiday stuff and you know that's the time that we decorate or put up stuff like, you know, the little, little, uh, baby Jesus. And one of my favorite books I like to put up, um, Away in a manger, no crib for his bed. The little Lord Jesus lay down his sweet head <laughs> i don't know. there's so many awesome christmas songs to start singing and getting into the spirit to sing um and know that you are loved god loves you so much that's what it says god loves you so much he saw you he saw that's that's my child you are not an accident you are not you know unworthy to be loved you are worthy to be loved by god by jesus um, so he loves you so much and it's like the truest love to me his love feels like my mom's hugs that's what it feels like like a best friend that you need in your life so you make time for him in the morning um whether it's like five minutes you know you get down on your hands and knees Lord Jesus, be with me today Lord Jesus, thank you for this wonderful day Thank you for that. I am blessed with my kids, Lord Jesus. Um, I thank you, Lord Jesus, for my nieces and nephews, Lord Jesus. And you just thank him for everything. And you'll just feel his love. You can feel his love now. <laughs> you start being like Thanksgiving time. Be thankful. Um, so during Thanksgiving, I don't really like getting a turkey because it's just kind of me. And so every time I look at the turkey, I was like, should I cook it? Will I be able to eat it all week? Um, I'm usually thankful for fish and berries. And so that's what we're going to celebrate with is fish and berries. <laughs> we'll make the other traditional meals of Thanksgiving. But um, turkey day, we usually go to my my sisters and celebrate with her and that's just my favorite time to go uh, eat with family and stuff family and friends and just enjoy the holidays so hopefully you guys are enjoying the holidays um, if not you can do you know virtual Facebook um, not Facebook uh, I don't know what this is Called for you to do. oh FaceTime. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting. I feel like so old. I don't use that that much, but I know the kids like to use that. Uh, I still don't like the online things for Zoom. For if I need to go 
and do other things that I'm kind of interested in. Uh, I learn over Zoom. And I find that kind of, it's okay, but I'd rather kind of be there in person, especially if I need help on like assignments or anything. Uh, it says, Dear Heavenly Father, I know that I'm a sinner and I ask for your forgiveness. So everybody makes mistakes. Uh, we've all made mistakes and God has for, forgiven you through Jesus. He loves you so much and he wants you to turn away from bad things. Again, I didn't know Jesus was returning until about eight years ago. It's been eight years and then it would take me a few months after that dream on October 16, 2013 to upload the message. Um, again, Jesus not only saved me, but he came uh, to me. Um, I don't know if it was one of the lowest points in my life. Um, but so much was going on. And he, like he plucked me out and sent me where I needed to be uh, to go home. Uh, I know that I'm a sinner and I ask for your forgiveness. I believe you died for my sins and rose from the dead. I turn from my sins. I invite you to come into my heart and life. I want to trust and follow you as my Lord and Savior. In Jesus' name, amen. It's a Billy Graham prayer. It's at findmyhope.org. Or you can call CBN at 1-800-775-9413, www.cbn.com. That's a real prayer line. Again, I jumped about eight years ago. Just return. Okay, Typed it out. This is Jesus, messages, testimony, and whatnot. It has that day. Again, I wrote this out by hand. And so, on one of the times I first wrote out that Jesus is returning. Um, again, he warns according to Joel 2 verse 2, 8, that he'll part his spirit in the last days. And that people will prophesy of his soon return. Um, so he's giving you ample time to get ready, repent. Once you say this prayer, it's a very healing prayer. It's very rewarding if you mean it in your whole heart. Um, Jesus really loves you. You'll feel his love. Have faith. Don't doubt. Um, so doubting is not of God. Um, having weird fear about certain things that's not of God. <laughs> You can pray about that, that God take, God take my anxiety away, take my, whatever you're feeling, God will take it, amen. You can always count on prayers, and those that love God and Jesus that are filled with the Holy Spirit, they'll pray with you. Um, so be thankful for all that you have, amen. For some people don't have that much. <clears throat> they start thinking, oh, I have, don't have things to be thankful for. You should be thankful. Uh, for everything and if you have much you know God gives you uh, the opportunity to tithe or do offerings so in the book of Acts um, the Jewish people finally went to the Gentiles because um of this man who was offering to the poor, his prayers went up, uh, alms that went up to Father God, and he heard this man's prayer, and he went and went, the Jews went to go teach him about Father God and Jesus, um, the ones that were saved, the apostles. And so they talked to him about Father God and Jesus, and they were talking, oh, we can't eat unclean food, we've never been whatever and God said what I what I have made clean you can eat amen um, so don't despise how people celebrate um, Thanksgiving you know with whatever food they have that's that's what God blessed them with amen and if they enjoy that uh, that's pretty awesome Alrighty, it's a good day. It's finally warming up out there. Hopefully you guys are having a good day. Uh, it's one of my favorite things to do. Uh, talk about Jesus. Tell you about Jesus because his wonderful love is awesome. It's real. Um, Alrighty, hopefully you guys are having a good day. I'll talk to you guys later. Goodbye.